the basic problem with capitalism is it has made us all money centric, self centric. We are chasing money. Money has become an obsession because of the way capitalism has been designed. And sometimes it becomes uh, addiction. We don't know why we are making money, but we can't get out of it. Why we make money, what is the purpose, we don't know. It becomes a means and also it becomes an end, which is a meaningless concept. So what I'm saying, why don't we go back and redefine ourselves? What is it that human beings are all about? I think the economists went wrong, they misinterpreted human beings. Human beings are multidimensional beings, not one-dimensional money-making robots. So we want to have this human being, the full human being into it, then we build the whole conceptual framework. In that, we will not only do things for ourselves, we also, within the business world, will do things for others too, uh, solving problem. Business is an excellent tool for solving problem. We have enormous capability, we have enormous creativity in our hands, enormous technology in our hands, but all this creativity and technology are being used for making money. If we had used this technology and creativity in solving problems in a business way, all these problems would be solved. And that's the idea of social business and we have created a lot of those social businesses in Bangladesh. And many of the multinational companies now joining hands with us to create social businesses. One of them is a joint uh, venture with the Danone. We have Grameen Danone company to produce yogurt to solve the problem of malnutrition among the children of Bangladesh. And Danone and, uh, and Grameen will never take any dividend out of it because whole company is dedicated to solving problems in a business way. Company makes profit, profit stays with the company. Uh, and we can take back only the investment money. So this is a new concept of business. If we have business of both kinds, profit-making business and social business, then the world will be completely different. Each profit-making company can create a social business on the side to address a local problem or international problem, whatever problem it is, uh, to solve it in a business way. And if we all of us are doing that, then all the problems piece by piece will be resolved. One of the things that I would like to imagine, a set of things that will emerge 30 years from now, that will be a world which we will create ourselves by creating new conceptual framework, where there will be nobody who will be known as unemployed person. Why should anybody be unemployed? There's nothing wrong with a human being. The young person, fully capable, creative person, why he or she will be wasted away? What kind of system is this? All these things we put as in our agenda, look at as our dream, as our vision, and work for it. If we work for it, it will happen. One of the most important things that is happening today, the distance between impossible and possible is shrinking.